of water to make it. Not sure how sustainable those things are, but. <coughs> so it's a how to Thursday. Let's get down to it. So we got shifting gears on a bike, and I think this is uh, this is a very common skill to know how to do. Good morning. I so pretty much most bikes are, are going to be pretty similar on this that have gears. You pretty much have. Good morning. You have a shifter on the left and a shifter on the right. Good morning. See, her gear is a little geared low so that she does a lot of RPMs, which is fine. You're gonna work more cardio that way. You can also do it a little harder and you're gonna work the pure muscles. So there's a kind of a trade off between what gear you want. But in general, you wanna find a rhythm and tempo that works for you. And then you're gonna set the big, the big different changes with the left hand gear and that's gonna change your front chain. So for these levers, there's little hand levers. Move them down, move them up. And that's gonna change these gears down here. Just like that, see? Already, that changes our RPM down there. So, good morning. Now we're gonna bring that back up. Going a little harder gear. And then we can change the back with lots of different clicks. With this lever here. And that's changing our back. So that goes, that goes, wow. Now that goes to the gears in the back, changing those. So you want to find a good ratio that works typically somewhere in the middle of the front and in the back. You're going to be happy. Good morning. So you want to keep that chain straight between the two gears. You don't want high in the front, real low in the back. That kind of creates an angle, messes up your gears over time. You don't want real low in the front and real high in the back. So, you know, middle, middle, and then adjust for accordingly. Of course, change for variation and elevation. Good morning. Change for variation elevation. That'll help you enjoy your ride a lot. That's the side.